Right, hey guys, I'm having technical difficulties. I just set up the Osmo on the um, just set up the Osmo on the phone. Right, Friday today. I'll try and get this one up for you. Um, kind of a day in the life on a Friday. Um, I've been feeling really nervous about filming. I think it's because I haven't filmed for a while. But to hell with it. I'm filming. Um, my reading glasses on now. What are you like, Mr. Cheese? Right, hold on, put your driving glasses on. Don't get old, guys. Don't get old. Right, I just, I wasn't going to film. I've got loads of new jobs. Um, I've got loads of new jobs coming in. And I don't like to get there and shove a camera in everyone's face, as it were. So, oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Now, I don't like to, <laughs> I don't like to go around getting new jobs and keep saying, "Can I film in your garden?" But I, I did this. Now, because of the birds, were you? So, because there was that. Bit to do. You've got quite a lot of horticulture, isn't it? Yeah. So there's that border to do. So what we, so it would be the border to start with in the lawn, wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, the patios we can do sort of first, I suppose, really, or earlier on. This just gives me an idea. I've got a few people to see today. Um, and I'll, for, I'll get blurred as to who was who. Just done this job for a lovely couple. Um, I power washed all down the side, round the rear, um, down the bottom of the garden. I put the footage up, you can have a look. Um, when I power wash, I move everything and clean under it. I even clean the table and chairs for this couple because they got the same. Wouldn't do it normally, but I knew my machine would clean it. So, clean the tables and chairs. I cleaned up down the bottom. I like to think it's being professional. I don't know. I move stuff about, put it back where I got it from, but clean it. Um, what the hell is wrong with my device? It's falling away from the camera thing. Oh, I'm still filming, but it's disconnected from the phone. I don't know. As long as it doesn't fall out and hit the ground. I'm going to have to pull in and deal with this problem, and then I'll get back to you. When I can find somewhere to pull in, that is. It's like my whole tree stand is about to fall apart. I don't know, and it's really hot in this truck as well. Talk amongst yourselves or something. You know, I will finish today's video if it kills me. Hopefully it won't kill me, that is. Right, lay by. Thank the Lord. On a block of driveway there. Right. Right, power washed the patios. Had to move the seat, did behind the seat, pulled all the ivy out, it was under the seat. <coughs> moved all the pots. Power washed under all the pots. Found the edging, the concrete edging that was said to be there weeded, leaf blowed, pruned back with secateurs. Don't want to disturb any birds that are nesting so I haven't done any hedge cutting or anything. Yeah so about a day and a half's work. A lot tighter than it was. I um, moved a lot of stuff about and cleaned under it, tidied up down this end, 
couldn't do too much on the shed because it, it would strip the paint off but I cleaned the shed as best I could done that border yeah so another another tidy job <laughs> 